Greetings, sir. This may concern Christian Aguilar here back with another reaction video. I know I do a lot of reaction videos. There will be movie reviews coming down the line along with uh, series reviews, uh, more specifically each season. So I'll be reviewing a TV show by season moving forward. But regardless, in today's reaction video, I'm going to be reacting to the just released, just dropped today on Tuesday, May 17th. May 17th, <laughs> 2022. Uh, She-Hulk, Marvel She-Hulk, Attorney at Law. Yeah, that's what it's called, Marvel She-Hulk, Attorney at Law. Um, I am, I don't know how I am about this series. I saw a couple, I saw, I remember, I remember I saw the teaser. I was like, cool, let's get She-Hulk, man, because I know uh, Incredible Hulk started off as a TV show, and then now they're going to give a TV show treatment to uh, She-Hulk. So I thought it would be, I, I thought it was a nice introduction. But now we have a full, uh, I guess, official trailer, first look at it. Let's jump right in. I have not seen anything of it, so... This is it, my first uh, first time watching this. Uh, let me. Uh, I hope it's hope it's good. Let's see. Let's see what we. Uh, let's see what Marvel's got cooking up for She-Hulk. Pressing play now. Being a superhero. Classic establishing shot. Is a trial by fire. Heavy colored lighting. Who's gonna protect the world? It's typical, typical. People like you. Oh shit! This is part of the teaser that we saw earlier. I like how she has the I'm classic Jennifer Walters. Suit I'm a lawyer. I from, have uh, great friends. Can we get some shots, please? It's an emergency. A <laughs> demanding job. We just started a superhuman law division, and I want you to be the face of it. Wow. Oh, Tim and Roth. A frustrating family. They got Tim Coach, Roth in here. You didn't ask for this, but you still got to deal with it. Your transformations are triggered by anger and fear. Those are like the baseline of any woman just existing. Oh. <laughs> Bruce, I feel like if I don't transform, I'm gonna die. Okay. Hers is fear, yes, while his is yes, anger. Yes. Cool. No. No. <laughs> I just want to be a normal, anonymous hmm. lawyer. Can you tell us where She-Hulk hmm. is? Jen, you're a story. That CGI now. looks a little off. Oh, that Girl, CGI. Yeah, it looks, looks really off. Crazy off. right now. She looks too animated, man. Is it just me? You could be an Avenger. Oh, I'm not a superhero. That's that cool. is for billionaires and narcissists and adult orphans for some oh. reason. She looks like a... Yeah, she looks like a video game character, man. What's with that? Is there anything more depressing than dating? Yeah, look at that. That's too yeah, animated, man. This is the best man. that I've had in a while. Oh. Should we split some fries? Let's get those to go. Uh. Oh damn! Oh damn! This show is just gonna fuel the mommy fetish, huh? The big, gigantic, tall women fetish that, that people got going on. Um, that's hilarious. That's hilarious how the trailer decides to finish like that. <laughs> but oof, man, that CGI. Is it just me or is that not looking too hot? Um, everything looks decent. Everything looks good besides She-Hulk herself when she's finally the green you know, gamma ray version of herself, it looks way too animated. Um, I think that that was a lot, you know, it's so weird when it comes to Hulk and the special effects, uh, even back, I think it was uh, Infinity War where he was in the Hulkbuster suit when he took off the helmet portion and Ro Mark Ruffalo's head was sticking out. That looked so, so weird and so off that I just couldn't help but laugh during what should be like an epic moment, which it still was. Thor arriving in uh, Wakanda during Infinity War was such a sick moment. But just that cut to Bruce is like, oh, you're so screwed now. That that whole effect it just clearly looked photoshopped. And I'm just like, oof, that's rough. That's really, really rough. So And this show is just screaming roughness. Hopefully that's not what the end product looks like. It's a little off-putting that this is the official trailer and we're still getting like not so good looking cgi um usually it should be like the polished version of this if it's not it's interesting how they released unpolished unfinished work um as an official trailer but i hope that's the case i hope that is and i hope by the time we get the series it looks way better than this um i, I feel like there's going to be some fan backlash against this because i mean already looking at the the likes 151,000 compared to like a million 1.5 million people that have already viewed this, but only 151,000 of them liked this. That's pretty low for Marvel. That's pretty low for Marvel. So, yeah, I'm, I'm just quickly scrolling through comments right now, and I'm seeing a bunch of bunch of jokes. Yeah, so there's some people that are still excited, and then there's other people that are like, yeah, no, we can't. 
the CGI ain't doing it for us. So um, hopefully they fix that up. If not, I think Marvel's going to have a dud on their hands. Another one. Um, but only time will tell, man. Only time will tell. Let me know what you think of the trailer down below. Are you excited? Are you, is it just me? Or is there some bad CGI in this as well? Maybe my eyes are confusing me. I don't know. But it's not looking too hot. But anyway, regardless, let me know what you think of it down below. Thank you so much for reading to the end of this video. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Support the channel. The rendered image is show I call my good friends Tyler and Shannon. Going over all the latest movie news, updates, and trailers. We will be going over this trailer because it's Marvel. And we're all into Marvel and stuff. So it's going to be interesting to hear what those guys have to say. So stay tuned for that. Link to that channel will be down below in the description. I hope you're all safe and well out there. And I'll see you all in the next one. Take care.